So we get back on the road this week, headed to Butler first and then to Valparaiso. And, and Butler is always a difficult matchup for us. They um, are a very, very structured team uh, with very skilled players. They run a lot of sets. So far we've counted over 30 set plays that they run. Um, preparing for them is always a challenge because there are so many things uh, that they could potentially do and we have to choose the ones that we think maybe we'll have the most trouble with or that we think they'll run against us. Butler's always been a great matchup for us. You know, uh, we've typically split with them, although that has, you know, in the last couple of years, but we're both very different teams now. So, um, you know, it's, it's, this is a really important game for us. It's the most important game on our schedule right now. So we're looking forward to giving our best effort at Butler. So, Whereas Green Bay might have felt like this was, you know, this is the team that beat us. Really, it wasn't the, the girls that beat them. It was maybe, you know, it was Cleveland State, but it wasn't the girls that beat them. Um, and that si similar thing is true here with the Butler game. Um, it just, it was a lot of Kaylee Klein and Angel and Jessica Roke and Stephanie Crosley. Now we're a different group. And so um, our, our girls aren't really talking about a revenge, you know, concerned about a revenge factor. I think um, Janelle and I are both still trying to sort out the kind of point guard that she's going to be and, and how that benefits our team. Um, as I've said before, Janelle is very different than any point guard we've had here or any point guard that I've coached. Um, her challenge is to find a way to be her own player and fit into the system that we have. Um, she's watched, you know, Angel and Jessica Roke play the point guard position, and she's not like Angel and Jessica. You know, they're very structured, very disciplined um, players, and Janelle is very explosive and creative, and we have to find a way to, to fit her into what we're doing. I think our defense um, still has a long way to go. I think uh, that we're finding uh, what we're capable of defensively. Um, I haven't always been 100% pleased with our intensity and effort on defense. I think we're capable of being a tremendous defensive team. Trying to sustain the kind of um, defense, defensive intensity when you play a low number of players. You know, I'm only playing seven, seven kids in a game. So um, being able to sustain that for 40 minutes when I'm asking some of them to play 38 minutes is, is sometimes a difficult task.